degree guarantee. Sponsored by your Wisconsin Chevy Super Dealers. All right, welcome back to Procknow Field where the Hornets are warming up immediately behind me from Preble. Here's a fun fact for you. I graduated from Linden State College in Northern Vermont. My mascot, the Hornets. My colors, green and yellow or green and gold. So you know what, I feel right at home this evening here uh, at Preble High School. I feel like I'm back in Vermont and I'm enjoying college. <laughs> I just wish I felt that young. Just kidding, I do. All right. Temperatures this evening in the 70s across the area. It's been a beautiful day and we've got a beautiful night of football on the way. It is currently 75 degrees here in northeastern parts of Green Bay, where we are currently getting set to play some high school football this evening. Still looking at nearly 80 degrees in both Appleton and Wapaka. The time lapse from this afternoon shows lots of sunshine mixing with some high cirrostratus clouds and also just a few puffy fair weather cumulus clouds. But there was some rain across parts of northeast Wisconsin earlier today. Our first rain in six days. We had some rain in Green Bay. We had some rain across the Fox Valley. And this evening, we're still looking at some scattered showers across far northern Marinette County, moving into northern Door County. That activity developing on the backside of a high pressure system that's been controlling our weather all week long. It's been high and dry and cool. Temperatures have been below normal or right at normal for roughly the last five or six days, but things are about to change. The clockwise flow around that area of high pressure is producing southerly winds across the central and northern plains, which means it's starting to heat back up again. Lots of 80s to our west, and that warmth is headed our way as we move through the weekend and into next week. In fact, tomorrow will be the warmest day in over a week which means it's going to be warm at Lambeau. Here's a look at your Go Pack Go forecast. Kickoff temperatures in the lower 80s by the fourth quarter, mid 80s. Lots of sunshine mixing with just a few clouds. Look for a high of 86 in Plainfield tomorrow, 84 in Howard. A little bit cooler near the lake, but beautiful across the Door Peninsula. Look for a high of 78 degrees in the Jacksonport area. Now on Sunday, we continue to warm up mid to upper 80s, so kind of flirting with 90. 90 has been very elusive so far this year. We've only had three days this summer with high temperatures at or above 90, and that's below normal. But we've got a chance for some more 90s here as we head into early next week as a big dome of high pressure builds across the central part of the country. It's going to be a heat dome. Record highs Sunday through Wednesday range from the lower 90s to the upper 90s. Most of those records are safe, but a few of us could come close, especially Monday or Tuesday. So tonight, an isolated shower across the north lows around 60. Tomorrow, warmer and increasingly humid. Sun and clouds. My three degree guarantee is 84. If I can hit that high within three degrees, we will donate $100 to New Community Shelter. And we did that today. I forecast a high of 80. The actual high temperature was 78 degrees. 88 on Sunday, right around 90 Monday and Tuesday. Then a system moves through behind it, some cooler weather with a much better chance for some organized showers and thunderstorms as we start thinking about wrapping up the month of August. We'll be right back. <laughs> 